You're perfect, Ariana. <laughs> okay. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Olivia. And I'm Ariana. And today we're doing October favorites. So first we're gonna start with clothing items that we're loving this month. So my first item is my oversized denim jacket. I got it from Brandy and I wear it all the time. I think I've worn it every single time we've gone out. Yeah. Except for maybe like twice when it was way too hot. But even like in Southern California where it's like summer still at this time of year, it's so nice. It's not too heavy, but it's like, it has like a quality like feel to it. Mm -hmm. Mine is also denim, but it's not a jacket. It is these BDG jeans from Urban Outfitters. They are high-waisted and they have a rip at the knee and then they have paint and it has frayed bottoms and they're just the coolest jeans I've ever owned so I, f I think we both can agree that yeah. if you're going to splurge on anything it should be denim because mm -hmm. it's going to last a really long time. My second clothing item is this long cardigan from Forever 21. It has two pockets on the side. It's very long and I really like it because um, since I'm pretty short it's hard to find like oversized items that fit like petite frames, so I feel like this works really well for my body. Another favorite of mine this month are these trainers that I got um, from Nike. They're pretty cool. They have like a rose gold um, little swoosh. swoosh. I find that these are a lot better for me to kind of hold my place when I'm lifting weights, especially on leg day. Um, I, I usually use my Nike fly knits, but it's like they're not flat, so they're like squishy and you're like trying to lift up. So I feel like these are just essential. I don't know if you guys have tried them. Um, if you guys have and you guys love them, comment below. Another favorite of mine is my backpack, my Kankin backpack. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that. <laughs> it's like a magic backpack. There's just so much like room inside of it. It's crazy. Like I put my laptop in there, I put my camera, I put, I have like a dentist pouch for my braces that I carry around with me everywhere. She carries it everywhere. She'll just pop it out of yeah. wherever we are, just on the table as if it's like a normal thing. In fact, it's right here. And see, it carries so many things. I even have an emergency suit inside of my backpack. <laughs> <laughs> so. Shout out to Campbell's. In all seriousness, this backpack is amazing. Awesome. <laughs> it really is great. It has back support. It's also weatherproof. It has two pockets for um, water bottles on each side. And they're pretty deep, yeah. actually. And it doesn't- They go like all the way up to here. Yeah, it's crazy. And it doesn't look huge. It looks like a little backpack and it carries so much stuff. So if anyone's looking for like a backpack for school or just for like taking around, this one. And then another favorite of mine is this beautiful bucket bag that I got that I'm so obsessed with because it was $12. And it was regular price 45 so for me, when you get a deal like that, I mean, you kind of have to love what you're buying. But I just, I wanted a bucket bag for a really long time, and when I found this one, it has like a forest green inside. So one side's black, the other's green, and it's even like that in the inside. There's a lot of room, and it's not heavy, it's super comfortable, so yeah, this is, this is my baby right now. And it's just super cute. Yeah, because just look at it, you know? <laughs> So for beauty, I have a few things from Glossier. So if you know me, I'm obsessed with Glossier. I own almost every single product that they've put out. Basically. Yeah. <laughs> but my favorites, favorites, favorites from them are the Supers. So the Supers are relatively new. They're like a skincare serum. And there's three different types for, you know, when your skin is feeling some type of way. So like there's Super Bounce, which is for softening your skin, which is my favorite. This one's, the consistency is really nice. Super Pure is for when you have like a blemish or something, you can put it straight onto it. And then Super Glow is when you just need to like brighten up your skin. The other two Glossier products I own are Boy Brow and the Lipstick Generation G in Leo. So Leo just came out a few weeks ago but it's already my favorite. I wear it almost every single day. And Boy Brow is probably my favorite that product that I've ever owned, like makeup wise. I own black and brown because I use two different shades on like two different parts of my eyebrow. I use black on like this part and then brown on the rest. So I only have these two and they're not Glossier. Um, the first one is a Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color. 
in the shade Forever. And it's, it's, oh my gosh, it's the prettiest color I've ever had on my lips because I'm not a big fan of lip anything on me. Um, I don't like the feeling of something on my lips. So the reason why I like this one so much is because it's like, it feels like velvet, but it dries up matte. It looks like a mauve shade, but it's actually like a pinky brown. It's like my lips, but better, mm -hmm. which is why I like it a lot. The second one is actually, I think it's like a sample one that they send to you or they give to you for your birthday. Um, it's the what the What's Up um, from Benefit. And it is a really good highlighter. Even though I have oily skin, I feel like it doesn't make me look greasy. It just gives like a really nice like sheen on the skin. Another beauty product that I love is this perfume by Le Labo called Santal 33. I don't even know how to describe this smell. It's so unique. I've worn it every day since I've got it and it's just my favorite perfume ever. Like, I don't even know how to describe it. I think it's like just... It's like the unicorn of perfumes. Yeah, it is. Like, because it's not a masculine nothing, smell, like it's it. not a feminine smell. And like she said, there's nothing like it. I've never smelled anything that comes close to this. Mm -mm. So another favorite of mine is this book called How to Be Parisian Wherever You Are, Love, Style, and Bad Habits. And it's amazing. I haven't finished reading it yet, but it's because I read it in pieces. The way that the book is set up is it's kind of like they have fashion advice, skin advice, um, just kind of like little snippets into like the Parisian lifestyle and both of us are like wannabe French girls. Yeah. So this is like the new Bible. It's amazing. 100% recommend this book for anyone who's into fashion, skincare, beauty. Just or like a lifestyle. Yeah, Even if you just want to know about it. Mm -hmm. It's I haven't read it but she doesn't shut up about it so yeah. I'm assuming it's pretty good. Very good. So this is my favorite of all favorites this month and Yes, it is a laptop, and yes, it is a MacBook Pro. Um, I'm not trying to show off, but this is my first MacBook, so I'm kind of obsessed with it. And I'm even more obsessed with it because it has a leather skin. This is my baby now, and it's like, ugh. I just, it makes me really happy, and shout out to my parents for buying this for me. One of my favorite things just overall, like not just for October, it's just my favorite Thing She's talked about it in other videos. I have. And it's this candle from Anthropology. Oh my god, it's the best candle ever. I actually bought it when we went to Santa Monica. And if you haven't seen that vlog, I'll link it down below. It's but so it's so good. It smells, I don't even, I can't describe this smell either. But if you've ever been to Anthropology, it's that smell. It's like Skittles mixed with happiness. Yeah, it's just happiness and a little beautiful and even, jar. Even the jar is beautiful. Yeah, like, it's like marble. It's like a rustic, mm -hmm. like rose gold. Yeah. The smell is beautiful and I will never stop talking about this candle. Um, our first favorite song this month is um, by Toe Lo. It's called Cool Girl. Oh my gosh. It's so good. We both <laughs> we both found it from the lineups video. Yeah. It was I think it was their night lookbook. Yeah, it was an amazing lookbook and just the song and the clothing that they were wearing and like just the cinematography in that mm -hmm. in that video was super amped up from all the other videos. So props to the lineup. Mm -hmm. I'm so obsessed with your guys' videos and yeah, every time we watch your guys' favorite videos, like we end up listening to the music. Yeah, it's so, great. I've been so obsessed with Bitter Sea by The Braves. I showed it to Olivia. Mm -hmm. um, it's just the vibe of the song is so good. It's like so chill, but it's it's like I don't even know how to explain it. Um, it's like when you're trying to relax, but then you're like just trying to enjoy life, and it just somehow brings those two together, and it just makes me super happy. So if you guys haven't heard it, you guys should really check it out. My favorite for music is always going to be Taylor Swift during the fall has to be i've been blasting 1989 and red like crazy this whole season and you know i heard that there's rumors that she's coming out with the new album this weekend and that's just driving me crazy so if anyone else is looking forward to that comment down below or like the video you know you want to. <laughs> so that's it for today's video we hope that you guys enjoyed it as much as we enjoyed making it stay tuned for more if you have any ideas or if you have any suggestions as to what we should film or questions on yeah. what we showed you guys today, mm -hmm. just comment down below. Thanks. Bye. Bye.